pointing the finger at Israel and the U.S. for the killing of one of its top nuclear scientists. Iran said it was ready to defend itself against any acts of foreign aggression in a scathing letter to the United Nations. Warning against any adventuristic measures by the United States and Israel against my country, particularly during the remaining period of the current administration of the United States in office, the Islamic Republic of Iran reserve its right to take all necessary measures to defend its people. Mohsen Fakhizadeh, the man widely considered to be the architect of Iran's nuclear program, was killed in an ambush east of Tehran on Friday. Nobody claimed responsibility for the attack, but Iranian officials, including Foreign Minister Mohammad Javad Zarif, were quick to blame regional rival Israel, which it has accused of assassinating several prominent scientists over the past decade. In 2018, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu even singled out Fakhizadeh in a presentation on Iran's nuclear ambitions. This is how Dr. Mohsen Fakhizadeh, head of Project Ahmad, put it. Remember that name, Fakhizadeh. The killing is likely to heighten regional tensions and further strain Tehran's relationship with the U.S. Since pulling out of a landmark nuclear deal in 2018, Donald Trump has repeatedly sought to isolate Iran while working to normalize ties between Israel and its other regional foes. Last week, Benjamin Netanyahu met with Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman in Riyadh in the first reported meeting in history between the two countries' leaders.